You feel the need, the need for speed. We have three-time Olympic speedster herself joining us live in just a moment, Gail Devers. And Gail, I've always wondered, did you have an older brother that used to just chase you around the house? <laughs> Where'd you hear that story from? <laughs> I do. I have an older brother and I started running because he was bigger than me. He beat me up and he made me run. But I, I'm very thankful for it now, you know. Um, but he, he made the difference. He really did. And um, he saw potential in me that I probably did not see. Gail, yeah, so great to welcome you back into the Atlanta arena. This is where you won your, some of your gold medals and we're so proud of you. But what's it like being back in the ATL? Oh, it's always great to be in Atlanta. This is hot Atlanta and it really is. And you know, what we're doing is kicking off Day for Kids, which is what we're trying to do is have adults relive their childhood and really just remember what it was like to be a child when you were carefree with not a worry in the world. So we're asking you to get out and play all the little silly games that you played when you were little. And then from that, you'll remember that kids should be kids, adults should be adults, and we should make these decisions for, for kids. And a lot of the issues that they're facing, they won't have to face if we can take that burden off of them. Well, another thing, Gail, you're really supportive of the Boys and Girls Club. Tell us why. I'm the ambassador for the Boys and Girls Club. I adopted them because I truly, I, I mean, I did. I truly believe in what they are accomplishing and the difference that they're making in their lives, just like with Day for Kids. I mean, there's 15.1 million kids who go home every day and they do not have adult supervision. And the difference could be going to a Boys and Girls Club, which is a safe haven, which could truly, truly put you on the right path for your life. And Gail, to help those kids down the right path, what do you say to them? You know, I, like I said, when you asked me the first question, I am about setting goals for yourself and then working to actively accomplish those goals. Um, the Olympic Games was a goal that I set for myself a long time ago and I didn't let anything deter me. You may get sidetracked sometimes, but you have to come back and that's where that support system, that's where those positive mentors come in. And for me, that's where the Boys and Girls Club plays an uh, instrumental part that they can make a difference in these kids where they don't have to make a decision or are you gonna get your homework out? Absolutely you're gonna get your homework out because you're here at the Boys and Girls Club and we're all about positive things because positive begets positive. One thing's for sure, I love watching you run. Amazing. You have such grace and such poise. But now let me ask you, a lot of us out there are facing challenges. You've overcome so many. What advice do you have for us? I would tell them to first of all believe in yourself it doesn't matter what other people believe about you. You believe in yourself. Hold fast to your goals. Find that support system and that unit that can help support you and lift you up when times when you're down. You know, and that's what for, for me and for what, what I'm advising everyone to do, honestly, from my heart, is to go to dayforkids.org, click on find an event, find a local boys and girls club, and get involved. I mean, seriously get involved. There are kids out there who have so much potential who want to do things, but they may not have you know, like what I had. They may not have that positive influence that will tell them, yes, you can do this. These are your goals. This is the direction that we're going to go. You be a kid now, but in the future, you're going to be a great person and a great ambassador to come back and help another child and save their life. Well, you certainly are a great ambassador. They couldn't get any better and a fast one at that. We look forward to meeting you personally on Saturday. Thank you and same to you.